Notre Dame at Ohio State, biggest game of opening weekend. Um, what is it going to mean to you and your team to go on the road against the number two team in the country? Uh, we're, we're all really excited. We put a lot of preparation in this offseason. Uh, we're trying to go show, show everybody like what all the work we did and uh, how like we're a really good football team. Uh, Coach Freeman is new. He's brought some new energy. Tell me something specific he's done that's impacted this team. I think it's like the little things. Every single warm-up Coach Freeman says what's up to every single player. And I think that means a lot, knowing you have a coach behind your back and uh, supporting you all the way. He's good on that communication, right? He goes around to every single person. What does that mean? Like, hey, he's, he's looking at me right now. Yeah, it just means like you have a coach who sees you and you're just not like another man on the roster. He really cares about every individual player and then uh, how, how we come together as a whole. It's beautiful. Does it feel good? Like, man, he's he's got me. He's my guy. Yeah, it feels real good knowing you have your coach behind you supporting you in like every single decision you make on and really off the field. He's used some um, motivational techniques, I think, tactics. He told you guys about being 17 and a half point underdogs. Yeah. How did that sit with the team? I mean, I think it just really adds fuel to the fire. Uh, like our self belief, in, like within like within the team, super high right now, and uh, we're not letting anyone stop us. And uh, yeah, we're ready to go. What's great about Notre Dame football right now that none of us know because we don't get to be there and see you practice? Uh, I think the camaraderie between like the the team, our teammates, like everyone's really close, uh, position group, team as a whole, and I think that just makes us allows us to play better together, just having like an off the field relationship as well. Um, tell me a little bit about the the defensive challenge that Ohio State presents. They've got a lot of really good offensive players. Yeah, they have a definitely like for our defense, you're saying more particularly, like, they have a bunch of great players. But uh, I'm super like we got Coach Gold, and I really believe in him. I think the defense has really bought into what he's saying, and I think everyone having trust for one another and like trust for the coaches is uh, really really going to help us. You you get to go against them every day. You know you're having to to kind of I guess iron sharpens iron. What's yeah. new and exciting that you've noticed? trying to go up against them. And guys are really just flying around. You're going to see a bunch of different looks. Um, they always keep you on your toes. You always have to be locked in. Uh, never know what to expect with this defense. I think there's also a lot of questions about your offense. You know, new quarterback, a lot of new pieces. Tell me what has been working so far in fall camp. Like, wow, this is this is going to be nice. Uh, Coach Freeman says we're an O-line, D-line during program. I'm really proud of our O-line and the work they put in this summer. It's really, uh, we, we can really run the football. And I'm really happy about that. Then it opens up the passing game. And then we have Tyler who can do a lot back there. So we're really dynamic and we can, uh, we have a lot of people who can attack. What don't we know about Tyler yet? Like what's impressed you so far? Uh, I mean, I don't think anyone realizes how smart of a football player he is. He really knows how to like control the team. He's a great leader of like on and off the field. And I'm super excited to see like where he's gonna, where he's gonna take us this season. Give me an example of something he's done. You know, he gets named the starter and then he comes in and leads you. Give me an example that you were like, whoa, okay. I think it's really more so like, so me and Tyler have been roommates for a while. So like I've been able to see it like for a while now. Just him asked me, you want to watch extra film, trying to throw extra, extra balls. Just really just be prepared as possible. Like I think he's probably, the, he's definitely the most prepared person on the field. That's beautiful. Um, tell me a little bit about, um, you know, this is a new defensive system that Ohio State has. What, what will be important to attacking it? I mean, I feel like attacking it, well, first it starts with ourselves. We got to really know like what our assignment is, what our job is, and uh, really go execute. Like this weekend practice, we're focusing on like, how can we get better? Of course, we're looking at the other team, but you never know what's going to happen on Saturday. So we got to focus on ourselves, And then from there, we're going to just build on like what, we, what we've seen before in the past and how we're going to attack that. How is this game going to be unique for you and your parents? Yeah, I think for me, it's just my parents get to be there. Like, I have a bunch of family from Columbus, so, like, that's great they get to be there. But uh, it's just another big football game for me. Uh, I got a job to do. My teammates have a job, and we're going to go out and uh, really execute. Um, but tell me who's on the other team. My little brother, Sonny. Yeah, I'm super excited. I know, like, a super, it's really blessing, a big blessing, like, to have the opportunity to play with him at the next level. I know he graduated a year early, so seeing him there early, finally, uh, really, we haven't played together in a little bit, so I'm excited. Have you guys talked about this moment and talked about what might happen? Oh, we always talk about playing at like the next level. We always had big dreams and uh, so, like knocking some of them down uh, like day by day and like seeing like it unfold is pretty pretty amazing. What has your family done right to have two kids playing at two of the best programs in the country? Uh, I think they really push us. Like when we were younger, uh, we they really forced us like in school and on the field like to just be the best we can be. And uh, once we show them we really wanted that, they push us every single day. Where are your parents going to sit? How are they going to negotiate this? I think the ladies are all going to sit on one side of the Notre Dame side, and all uh, the males of my family are going to sit on the Ohio State side. Okay, cool.
Do you know how many tickets or family members you got coming? I think I got 10 coming. 10. Beautiful. Do we think, he, is there any chance he'll end up tackling you or do we think there's any chance you'll end up? Yeah, I mean, I think my brother is a great football player. So if the opportunity presents itself to him, I think he'll, uh, he can make it, I don't know about tackling me, but uh, I think he can definitely get on the field.